On this 50th anniversary of Title IX, the Drake Group awarded a special Title IX Student Journalism Prize for investigative reporting to 19 student journalists from the Shirley Povich Center for Sports Journalism and the Howard Center for Investigative Journalism at the University of Maryland. I asked Alexandra Gopin, a member of the journalism team who just graduated from the University of Maryland in December, to join me as I tell you about the work of the group. <laughs> Unlevel Playing Fields was an extraordinary work involving 19 student journalists, 13 editors, and 13 other students and faculty contributing data, digital design, and graphics, photography, fact-checking, and audience engagement. They conducted a four-month investigation of Title IX and high school sports, revealing a system that is failing countless girls. The investigation showed that boys are favored over girls in many ways, playing on better fields, wearing nicer uniforms, and receiving greater publicity from their schools. The work consists of 12 text stories, several video pieces, and a national poll of high school parents and their student athletes to measure awareness of Title IX. I should be standing up here with 18 other incredible student journalists, uh, but they're actually at commencement for the Philip Merrill College of Journalism right about now. Um, first, I want to thank the Drake Group for granting Unlevel Playing Fields this award. I'm so grateful to be accepting this award on behalf of the whole team um, after months of research about Title IX compliance in high school sports. Um, I also want to thank my professor and editor, Mark Hyman, who's sitting right here, um, because this project wouldn't exist without his valiant efforts to tackle such an important issue. Uh, what struck me most as I was interviewing many students and parents this year was how little awareness there is um, in high schools about the rights Title IX guarantees to women and girls in sports. Uh, parents and students agree that they want boys and girls to receive the same treatment. Uh, but I think it's about time that girls are made aware of the rights they're entitled to under law. Uh, this project does exactly that. It brings awareness to a crucial topic that doesn't get the attention it deserves. So thank you again to the Drake Group for recognizing our work with such an honor and for bringing attention to a topic that affects the lives of young women and girls every day. Thank you. Thank you.